So we're out here with some research scientists, we're just off Heron Island and we've seen some patchy recovery which is really positive. Uh, in, the, in the area that we're in at the moment, 90% of this coral bleached in last year's bleaching episode. Basically it's all hands on deck to try and help this beautiful ecosystem which is just enormous withstand the pressures of the climate crisis. As we know it brings extreme weather events to us with floods and fires but it also brings marine heat waves and that can lead to these mass coral bleachings. We've seen six mass coral bleachings in the last nine years and whilst we're seeing some regrowth here which is wonderful um, there's only so much that the coral can withstand and uh, that's why when we saw 90% bleach we've only seen 30% regrow so it's only so many times you can come back from that and as someone who saw this reef when I was 11 in a little island group just south of here it just stayed with me for the rest of my life and I want to make sure that everyone can experience this beauty and not just for humans to see but because this ecosystem is just so valuable uh, for its own sake. What an incredible experience to be here and uh, just reminds me of how important it is that we all do everything we can to try to reduce fossil fuel usage and help save this gorgeous planet that we're so blessed to live on. Authorised by Jay McCall, Australian Greens, Canberra.